Joseph's mother. Oh, right. No, I know. Hi, Catherine. Yeah. Our kids have gone to school together for eight years. I, uh, sorry. Hello, Joseph. I uh, hear our kids have been chatting online. Yeah, I heard that your wife has been screaming at my son, and I don't appreciate it. Excuse me? She screamed at my son, right? She threatened you? She screamed at you? She cursed at him? Okay, he's 13 years old, for God's sakes. What the hell is the matter with her? Okay, you better check her meds and get them right. Okay, you know what? Why don't you, why don't you back the fuck off? Because that's my lovely, sweet wife you're talking about. Oh, I need to yeah, back you off? you need to back off, because your kid is an animal. He's a fucking animal. Why don't turn you around. put him on a leash? Turn around, turn around, turn around! If he insults my daughter again, I'm gonna hit him with my fucking car. Got it? In fact, if you insult my wife again, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna show up your house when you're sleeping, and I'll take your iPad or your iPod or your iMac, and I'll shove them up your fucking eye cunt. I got nothing to lose. Your kid is the problem. My kid is a fucking angel. I don't have time for this shit. So I'm keeping it together. But if I wasn't a score right now, I'm gonna... Touch my... Touch me? I didn't touch you. Touch my upper breast. I didn't, I didn't. I got right below your shoulder. You got I right didn't... here. You actually, he hit my nipple. You what? You're insane. Why would you do that? Did you just touch my mom's nipple? He just touched my nipple. Why would I, you do that to I me? I poked you on the shoulder. I have very high nipples. I touched your shirt. What do you think is under my shirt? I just touched. My breasts are under my shirt. Your you just shoulder. My breasts. Your shoulder. Well, that's a funny place to put a shoulder on my boob. Hello? There are children around. This isn't over. This is not over. You're going to be sorry. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Why can't you just suck it up? Make fun of some idiots and stop thinking about yourself for once. Susanna, I know this is painful for you, but sometimes in life you have to do the right thing. Just lie. It's not that hard. I'm texting a lie right now. Oh! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Are you okay? Oh, yeah, I'm okay. Is that a Porsche? Yeah. Oh, wow. I have been hit by a Datsun before, never a Porsche. Oh, man. Barry Speck. Tim Conrad. Yeah. Uh, are, you, are you sure you're OK? I didn't see you. What were you doing? Oh, well, I saw this little guy in the street, and I was trying to save him. Uh, I think it's dead. Yes, that's why he couldn't run away. A couple more seconds, you would have squished him. Nice pelt, though. Ready? Uh, I, I hope those aren't for your lawyer. No, I would rather not have lawyers get involved. All right, I get it. You said you were fine, but what would it take to keep the lawyers out? Five. Oh. Five dollars. I don't, what do you mean? Ten dollars. Seriously, what, come on. How much do you want? Hundred dollars. I don't want anything. Five hundred dollars. I don't, it's okay. As long right. as you're okay, right. then. You ten thousand. Okay, I'll take ten thousand dollars. I don't have ten thousand dollars. You know what? Don't worry about it. Really? Yeah. As long as you're okay. Oh, you're a good person. No, it's all right. Oh. You are. You're a good person. Oh, thank you. No, you really are. You're a really nice person. All right, well, as long as you're okay, that's... Thanks. That's okay. Thank you. Yeah. You take care. Good morning. Can I take your order? Can I get a tall chai? A uh, large black coffee. A what? Large black coffee. Do you mean a venti? No, I mean a large. He means a venti. Yeah, the biggest one you got. A venti is large. No, venti is 20. Danny. Yeah. Large is large. In fact, tall is large, and grande is Spanish for large. Venti's the only one that doesn't mean large. It's also the only one that's Italian. Congratulations, you're stupid in three languages. Look, Dick, Venti is a large coffee. Really? Says who? Fellini? How much is that? Here's a 10. Do you uh, accept lira, or is it all euros? You know what? Just now? keep the change. Jesus, Dan, you know what they call sizes here. You know what? You've been picking fights with everybody. The girl at the party. She said ASAP. Oh, ASAP. Oh, I'm sorry. Huge crime. It's like 24-7 or been there, done that. You hate that, too. I don't hate it enough to let it ruin my day. It's getting worse. You know, man, the sun is shining, but you have lost the ability to take any joy in life. I, I can't stand it anymore. You're just a miserable dick now. You're mean to everybody. And FYI, it's called a venti because it's 20 ounces. 20. Venti!
Is that true? She says I take no joy in life. I can see that. I gotta talk to her. Ah, forget her, man. Let me give you a little motto I live my life by. You gotta hit it and quit it. No ties, tangle free. Nobody tells me what to do. I gotta go bang, bang, bang the drum. What? That's not a motto. That's that's just you saying a bunch of things. You know, that's right. I'm a dick. Hey, I'm, I'm in a rut, just going from school to school, selling poison to our nation's youth. It's not poison. It's got juice in it. You know, I'm 35 years old. I got nothing to show for my life. I figured it'd be something. Something good, a professor, engineer, I don't know. I gotta be married. I... Joseph was very upset when I spoke to him about this. So I thought it was important that we join together and work this through. Absolutely. Uh, we're gonna work through it. But Debbie uh, told my son that he looked like Tom Petty in a negative way. Who's Tom Petty? You know who Tom Petty is. And she said that if she had to come back, that she was going to F up his pussy ass, which is what she said. Oh, my God. Are you serious? I didn't. I would never. To a child, your son has been defiling my daughter's Facebook page now for months. These people are liars. He said that my son was an animal, and that if I didn't keep him on a leash, that he would hit him with his car. Did you say that? That's, that's ridiculous. Who talks like that? You do. He didn't say All that. All right, you he know, said it to no, me. what I said was that we need to keep an extra eye on our kids because with all the technological advances, uh, they need to learn to use them responsibly. No, no, what he, what he said to me was he called me an icon. A what? Language, Catherine, language. I'm quoting. How am I going to relay what these two nutballs said to me unless I say it? Can you please not talk like that, Catherine? Music Man is rehearsing next door. Sorry, fucking Music Man. <gasps> Maybe if I looked more like this fake bullshit couple. Looks like they're in a bank commercial. That's what you look like. Like you're a bullshit bank commercial couple. None of this talk is productive. I would like to rear up and jackknife my legs and kick you both in the fucking jaw with my foot bone. You're just really scaring me. This is what happens when you corner a rat. You corner me, I will fucking chew through you. I'll chew through you. Catherine, you're better than this. Fuck you, Jill. You're a horrible fucking woman. This is why everybody hates you, Jill. This kind of shit, ineffective, fucking bullshit hair. And I'm glad your husband died. Because you're a fucking asshole. He probably killed himself. Okay, Catherine, I think we know what's happening now. Now you know what we're dealing with. 